Tensions escalate further in the Middle East. Israel is conducting more airstrikes in southern Lebanon after it says it intercepted Hezbollah missile aimed at Tel Aviv. The Lebanese Health Ministry says 22 people have been killed today. British nationals are being urged to evacuate the region. Also in the programme... As the number of women alleging they were sexually assaulted by the Harrods boss Mohammed al fayed approaches 200, five of his accusers come together and call for justice. Initially, I didn't want to be involved because Mohammed was still alive, and as ridiculous as that may sound to people not involved, he still felt like a threat until the moment he died. A blow to the government in the closing moments of Labour Party conference as unions vote against bringing in cuts to the winter fuel allowance. And my chance to tell my side of the story. Philip Schofield makes a return to national TV 16 months after his controversial exit from ITV. And on Sports Day later in the hour on BBC News, the former Manchester United and Real Madrid defender and French World Cup winner Raphael Varane has retired from football at the age of 31. Good afternoon. Israel is conducting what it calls extensive further airstrikes on southern Lebanon, with the Lebanese Health Ministry reporting that 22